This week's Nut Job of the Week goes to one of the most ridiculous people on TV, Sean Hannity. This is a long time coming. He's one of the people who deserves the Nut Job of the Week every week for one reason or another. He's just the epitome of a political hack. He blames Obama and the Democrats for absolutely every problem ever and always wants more war, more tax cuts for the rich, less social programs. Just to show you how ridiculous he is, to this day, he's one of roughly 16 people in America who still take Sarah Palin seriously. So, what absurd nonsense is he spewing this week? Well, probably 762 examples exist, but let's just take these two examples. On his radio show, he did a segment about how union thugs in New York are forcing volunteer help from other states in response to Hurricane Sandy to leave because it's their territory or something like that. And in reality, this is just completely made up. He's trying to feed the typical right-wing narrative that unions are overpaid, lazy people, and he'd rather pay some less skilled, low-wage workers to take their place. And how do I know that he's making this up? Well, I actually have some first-hand experience because I live in Westchester County in New York, and it's an area that was impacted by Hurricane Sandy, and I was without power for six days, and it just came back on about an hour ago. And the people that were working on my block to get the power going were Pike Electric workers from Massachusetts and California. It wasn't Con Ed, which is the provider that we have in this area. So that's number one. If you can't make a political argument and score some political points based on reality, what does Sean Hannity do? Well, he just makes some shit up. He doesn't care. Number two, Hannity was screaming that the feds need to to do more to help the victims of Sandy when, of course, there actually has been a very well-organized onslaught of federal assistance which was in place and ready to go even before the disaster struck. Just ask Republican Governor of New Jersey Chris Christie if you don't believe me. But not only did Hannity flat-out lie about the FEMA efforts, his stance is a 100 an 80 degree turn from what he said during Hurricane Katrina when he defended the lackluster federal response under George W. Bush and he basically blamed the victims and he said the states need to do more that's not the federal government's job. So Sean Hannity as usual continues to act like the loathsome dumbass he is and this week he gets the nut job of the week.